Scott Jorgensen. As always, very well prepared, extremely focused, and ready to go to bat. Scott Jorgensen has a relentless style. He's got great dirty boxing and very effective takedowns. He's got a ton of cardio, and he uses that to push a frantic, tough pace. Scott Jorgensen enters the octagon. Pumped up, very confident, and ready to battle in the octagon. This guy's one of the toughest guys we've ever seen compete in the octagon. His ability to overcome adversity, to absorb punishment, and then come back to deliver his own is a really amazing thing to watch. is ready to go to bat in our main event of the evening. Our tail of the tape for this featherweight fight. Choi is 24. Jorgensen is 33. Choi will have a four-inch reach advantage. And once again, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Staples Center in Los Angeles, California. <laughs> This man is a freestyle fighter, holding a professional record of 15 wins, 12 losses. He stands 5 feet 5 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Boise, Idaho, Scott Young Guns, Jorgensen. And now to his opponent, fighting at the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 14 wins, one loss. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at a groovy South Korea, the Korean Super Bowl, Do Ho Choi. All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. The fight is finally here. We have been talking about this matchup for months. Both men ready to here lay it all First on round. the line. Ready? You ready? Let's here go. we go. Tonight's main event is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. White trunks for Jorgensen. Black trunks for Troy. Scott Jorgensen is a solid wrestler with very good stand-up skills and submissions as well. Tries a big hook to the head, but misses. He just whips that punch. Troy with a strong combination. Trying to get the takedown. Oh, my goodness, how quick was that, Joe? They're back up. Nice left, left kick to the ball. Now they're turning it up. It's a good kick. Solid leg kick. Nice jab. And there he swung with a haymaker. Good roundhouse kick to the midsection. Gonna take him down again. He's looking to pass here, Joe. Jorgensen with the left. 
Good punch. Joe, these fighters need to engage, or the ref's gonna stand them up. Sometimes you see this, sometimes you see two guys who are very evenly matched, and when it goes to the ground, they stifle each other. Just over three now. And he's got some good effectiveness going with the ground and pound. Troy with a nice punch. Man, a ton of damage has been done. And his left eye is really starting to swell up. He's trying to pass here, Mike. shot. Troy with the elbow to the head. He's really landing some very solid elbows. Stacking him, keeping the weight on him. Nice work from the bottom by Troy. Big body punch. Out of there. Good sprawl. Good strike here. He hurt him. Trying to stay out of trouble here. Powerful jab. There's a nice combination. Oh, head kick. Oh, and he eats a shot. Oh, stunning jab. Oh, big body kick. gets back up again. Head kick. Nicely done. Connected there. Good job blocking the punch. Both men landing in that exchange. Looking to take him down again. And there's some of that great wrestling from Jorgensen that we were talking about. Yeah, absolutely. Got some time to work here, 45 seconds. Jorgensen's looking to pass here. Slides him over, and nice reversal here. I'm gonna stand you up. And he's trying to pass. Back up to his feet again. And he pulls away. An inside leg kick. Oh, flying knee! Big punch! Wow! Oh, big shots! Oh, big right hand. Round one complete. Scott Jorgensen's ears are ringing for more than the bell that just saved him. He got stung right at the end of that round without question. Here's a huge kick that stuns. Here's a powerful punch that devastates. And let's see that from another angle. There's the beautiful Brittany as we get set for second. round two. You ready? You ready? Let's round go, two. Now, starting off this round, you've got to think that the barrage that he endured in that last round is still affecting him. He's going to want to start this round off and move and avoid taking any damage. Joe, look inside the numbers. Significant strikes landed. Another good strike. Jorgensen with the overhand. Good take down the fence. Look at Very that. nice. Wow! Wow! There's Huge a great shot. Left hand.
Able to pass to half guard. And he connects with the punch. Look at that eye, man. That is a mess. Not much going on, Joe. Yeah, this is a stalemate here. They seem to be canceling each other out. Or they're both taking a little bit of a breather. Back to full mount again. Postured up. Here's a little piece of trivia for folks who don't know. The reason why you're not allowed to do a downward elbow, 12 to 6, is because when they first brought mixed martial arts to athletic commissions, the people on the commission said, well, you can't let someone do that. I saw people break bricks with that on ESPN. <laughs> In reality, there's really very little difference between a downward elbow or a 45 degree elbow or, or what have you. Under three now. Choi's got the full mount again. Gets his back one more time. There he goes. Back to mount out. again. And he's going to transition to the back. And he's on top. Look at that. Again. He's got the back again. They're back up. Wow. Nice front kick. Look at this. Joe, look for him to shoot for another takedown here. Wow! Oh, that one hurt him. Really threw everything into that uppercut that fell short. Oh, what a beautiful goal. uppercut. Oh, yep. Joe, he's hurt. Nice takedown. Under 90 seconds now. Hard elbows, hard elbows. Right, Back up again. Flying knees. Oh, oh head kick. Kick. the kick. Oh, that's good a good shot. shot right there. Very good shot. Oh, that hurt him. That's it. Oh, he's out down. cold. And it is all over. Beautiful, accurate uppercut that got him the win. Time now for our fight replay. And here in the replay, we see this huge left hand landing for the knockout. Let's see it one more time from a different angle. Look at the power in this left as it shuts the lights out. Here it is one more time. Boom! Out cold. With the official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop in this contest at 3 minutes, 42 seconds of round number 2. Declaring the winner by knockout, the Korean Super Bowl, Du Ho Choi. Du Ho Choi, winner by knockout.